वेलकम टू पवित्र लैपटॉप केयर यर इज अ स्म वीडियो फॉर एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ कोर ऐ सी ई एस एल नईन फाइव एट डबल थ्री इट्स अ वेरी फेमस मदर बोर्ड एल ए ईफन नईन वन जीरो फोर पी मीन डेल इंस्पीरा थ्री फाइव टू वन बोर्ड सोमबड़ी वाण्स द एक्सप्लेनेशन ऑफ दिस पर्टिक्युलर ई सी कोर ऐ सी सो फॉर दम दिस वीडियो ओके see here core ic means everyone will get afraid right so here it's very simple so if you see in a simple way in simple manner definitely it will be very simple so in complicated way if you see this particular ic definitely it will be very complicated okay see in simple manner i'll tell you see any ic required input input voltage then only it will be complete circuits right so what is the input here general first thing we have to search for the input signal see pin number 21 and 22 vdd and here it's a plus 5 vs one vccp and vccp it's uh, ldo enables so vdd is a main uh, ic enable i mean ic supply and here one more is there i sense 2 see here it's a 5 volts as given any other voltage no any other pins are doesn't contains any voltage so this is the input for this particular ic what are the input pin number 8 pin number 21 and 22 22 is the direct vs 5 uh, vs direct voltage and vdd is through this particular resistor that also it's 1 uh, ohms so that also same voltage you will get okay input part over anything else no nothing okay second thing is any ic required enable signal so maximum ic is required enable signal so that is uh, we are on see we are enable it is from io right so this particular enable signals is coming from io that's it so next actually this particular ic has two phases two phases in the sense in previous motherboards uh you may know that 3 5 volts will be uh, getting from one ic so one ic having two phase so like that this particular having two phase what are those one is vcc core second one is vga core graphics core okay these two phases it has that's very simple so i'll explain one by one for that processor signals send signals required to this particular ic okay here what are the signals it required first one is alert see we are svd alert actually it's a input but i don't know why this armor has given output one kind of output hmm? second one is clock and data is common for anything hmm? to produce the pulses right so clock and signal i mean clock and data first is alert clock and data and after that temperature related uh, thermal sensor related uh, information has to go right so for that this we are at hmm? this one is pull up from vccp once vccp comes then only this ic will work okay next what it will be ntc ntc this also one kind of thermal uh, things this ntc is for vcc core and ntc g is for graphics core two phase which i told you know so two phase this is the number pin number 1 and 8 sorry pin number 1 and 7 for thermal related information next ntc over what else see these feedback and all output sense so now we won't take so we will directly come to boot 1 see this one one mention means it's a phase one boot one upper gate one lower gate one and phase see after these signals after we are on uh, clock data alert and uh, temperature related information then here boot one will generate hmm? next once boot one comes then upper gate will start and next lower gate will start and next you will get the phase one after phase one obviously you will get power good but before this power good some coil sense will be there see 
this Kyle sense. Okay, this Kyle sense see V sum plus and V sum minus. Where it will go? V sum plus and V sum minus. See one two and one two. So pin number ten and eleven. Right, one kind of a feedback. And here, see, it's a feedback as given here. Hmm? Comp also kind of one kind of feedback. It's over. Then finally, you will get V core power good. Very simple, right? Hmm? You will get V core power good. Next, if you come to this part, same thing. What? Boot G first. Next, upper gate, lower gate, and face. These all are graphics related face. Once these all are over, then you will get this RT NG feedback, RT N feedback. This sum that plus and minus. See, V sum plus and V sum minus. That actually it's a sense that Kyle sense it will accept. Hmm? Then the process will continue. But the second one the gate upper gate g and g g face is depends on graphics if you have external graphics then i mean this uh, internal only that if you have graphic chips then this core will work otherwise only v vcc core will work okay you got my point then the final output will be v gate for vcc core and here pg is imvp power good for graphics chipset that's it anything else this pad is ground hmm? hello right see sdacl we are on ntc ntcg hmm? i sense i sump i sump when rtn feedback um, power good boot what else everything over and one more thing is there here yeah, see p good will carry with this three vs this is the pull up register v gate is the output final output of this vcc core ic okay that's it so practically i will show you how it looks and what are the voltages what are the pulse you will get in this particular ic in this core ic the supply voltage will be pin number 8 21 and 22 those should be 5 volts So let us check those pin having input or not. The pin number eight. Yes, it has five volts. And the pin number twenty-two. Five volts. Pin number twenty-three having five volts. After this, pin number two, the enable signal V R on is available or not? We'll check. Here it is, 3.3. It's a V R on enable signal. V R enable signal. The pin number four alert. Alert we are getting or not? That we will check. Uh, it may be one volts. So that's why I am keeping D S O in one volts. So let us check pin number four. One two three four. See, pin number four having 1.05 volts. After alert, now it's a clock. Pin number three. Here is the clock. Hmm. The voltage is 1.01. I do the loss connection. It will come. Uh, you have pin number five. Pin number five. That is the S D A. This one is S D A. See, so 
some signal are passing here this is the data sda next signal is pin number 6 we are hot see it is in millivolts 117 millivolts hmm? next thermal information pin number 1 and 7 first we will check pin number 1 See pin number one having this kind of signal. <coughs> okay, this kind of sinusoidal wave form we can get in pin number one. That is NTC G. And what about pin number seven? See pin number seven also sinusoidal wave form we will get. Instead of voltage, we are getting sinusoidal waveform. What is that pin number seven? That is NTC, negative temperature coefficient. That's it. So remaining and all, it's a boot, upper gate, lower gate, and face. Okay. Here actually there are two upper gate, lower gate, and face. Here. Boot one, upper gate one, lower gate one, and phase one are related to V core. Okay. Next step, we will check one by one the boot one, pin number sixteen. See pin number sixteen having this kind of signals. Okay. This is boot one. P core boot one looks like this. Next, upper gate. What the pin number? Upper gate one, pin number seventeen. The upper gate. See the upper gate sinusoidal waves. It is in negative voltages, not in positive. So it is in negative voltages. This is upper gate. One means V core upper gate one MOSFET. Next lower gate, lower gate pin number nineteen. See lower gate output will be like this. Okay, now the face. The face one will be the pin number eighteen. So we change the position. It will looks like this. Okay, this is the face. Means it's a VCC core. Next, graphics related voltages. Graphics in the sense which one? Boot G, upper gate G, lower gate G, and phase G. We will check. Hmm? Now, boot G, pin number twenty-six here. Yeah. That is four point seven. So boot G doesn't have any graphics things, but it has. Voltage, pure voltage. It's a 4.7 voltage. Next, upper gate G, pin number 25. Here, this is not activated because here uh, without graphics. So that's why graphics related information not available. Lower gate G, for the pin number lower gate G 23. 23. So directly, I will check. See, there is no voltage in lower gate also because it's not producing without this board having without graphic card. So now face same thing, but need not to check. What else required? 
this actually it has two phase one is already phase vcc core and second one is for graphics core graphics core it not used here because it it doesn't contains graphics so second one is vcc core vcc core we already checked then output feedback and comp okay after this the sense will access the sense here actually one by one we will check the sense 91 it's not connected and pin number 10 we'll start from pin number 10 10 11 12 13 14 okay then it's actually very less voltage it's around 800 millivolts pin number 10 next 11 pin number 10 is P sum plus pin number eleven is V sum minus. That is uh, negative thing. So anyway, see pin number eleven having eight hundred milli volts. Pin number twelve VCC sense VSSN. That is a ground feedback thirteen. It has eight hundred milli volts. Okay, feedback having 800 millivolts. Number 14. This one, it's varying. It's uh, around 500 to 800, 600, 500. It's varying. One second, I'll check. See, it's jumping. Next, actually. In other pin we don't have, so that's why need not to check. Those are 28, 29, and 30. We don't have. Then final thing is output. What are the output? Here is the power good of uh, this one. Graphics one not available, but we can check the VCC core power good. That one is V gate. Pin number 15. pin number 15 maybe this is the final output pin number 15 ha ah, 3.3 it's a v gate this is the final output of this particular ic anything we left v gate is the power good of vcc it should be there then only it goes to Uh, processor and it will work normally. Hmm? NTC we are enable all we checked. So the final output is this. In case if any graphics voltage will be there, that pin number twenty seven will be the final output of graphics and pin number uh, what is that? Uh, pin number fifteen uh, is the V gate output power good output for V core. That's it. It's very easy. Hmm? Thank you. Thank you very much.